The mayor of Fort Lauderdale says storm relief is in dire need after historic flooding here. This morning, Mayor Dean Tarantellis is back here in South Florida. This is after a trip to Washington, D.C. to ask for federal assistance. Uh, much needed federal assistance indeed. As CBS News Miami's Trish Krasakis is live outside Fort Lauderdale City Hall. Trish and the mayor are going to be outlining some of these details of any progress. Yeah, you guys, good morning. Well, if you were impacted, hope our help is hopefully on the way. We'll be speaking with that mayor later this morning to get more details on what happened in those meetings in D.C. Now, of course, him and the city manager were there. Let's take a look. Now, we're, they met with the, the administration team for President Biden to help people who lost nearly everything from those floods we had a few weeks ago. Now, they were talking about federal funding and the need for that because more than 800 homes in Fort Lauderdale had a foot and a half of flood water. Businesses were destroyed. Many had no flood insurance and they're hoping for a FEMA disaster designation so they can apply for those grants. I'm trying to maximize the relief effort, try to get immediate relief for our people. So we feel we've certainly made a lot of headway. We're now waiting for FEMA and the White House to sign off on it and we're going to see recovery here in our city. And City Hall even suffered some flood damage. Mayor will be speaking here at 10.30 this morning. We'll have details on once that FEMA disaster designation is made. Flood victims may be able to get reimbursed for out-of-pocket expenses like water removal, removal, household items, hotel costs, and more. So you'll want to save all of your receipts. So once that is set up, the city will give you guys options and ways to sign up for aid. Reporting live at City Hall, Trish Krasek, CBS News, Miami. Well, it's going to be great to see what uh, the mayor was able to accomplish yeah. up there in D.C. He was only there for one day. so. Hopefully a lot. All right, yeah. Trish, thank you.